contested race tonight and joins us live in Kent County, Aaron. Yeah, Derek and Janice, it's looking like Michigan 3 will have a Republican nominee who's a political newcomer. We're at the socially distant campaign party for Peter Meyer, who's expected to take the stage pretty soon here. And Meyer, of course, that name holds a lot of weight in this area, but the campaign says that's something they wanted to avoid in running this campaign. They wanted to focus on his background in public and military service. We had a chance to speak with Meyer earlier tonight as those results were coming in. Now, this has always been a seat that's offered very strong, but also very stable leadership, going back to when it was the 5th District and President Ford um, cut his teeth in Congress from 1948 until the early 70s. And then guys like Paul Henry, Vern Ehlers, you know, a lot of giants have been in this seat before, and those are big shoes that I hope to fill. And really, our campaign has been about service. It's been about the community and about projecting forward how we're going to find solutions to the, some of the problems facing our country, but solutions that are based on conservative values like limited government economic freedom and individual liberty because that's what underpins just about everything that's strong with America. And Meyer says he hopes to keep this momentum going all the way into November in a general election that will have national attention and national eyes on it. He's likely going up against uh, Democrat nominee Hillary Skolton. But for now, live in Grand Rapids, Aaron Parsegian, Fox 17 News.